How'd today go for Purdue out at the Indiana Air Collegiate? Sure. Overall, you know, I'll start with the women. I think uh, Abby Hosteller definitely made a big breakthrough, uh, you know, by taking the overall title in the open race. That was really positive for her. And, uh, you know, if, if we translate that to a, uh, a 5K, I think she'd be pretty pleased with what her overall time would be uh, based on uh, coming off of a sickness that she just got over. So I uh, was really pleased with her uh, overall in the, in the championship race. I thought they did a great job stacking up against IU. Uh, you know, we were led by two front runners up there with Katie and Michelle. They did a phenomenal job of, you know, setting the tone for the team. And, uh, you know, overall the support cast right after there was uh, nothing short of spectacular. So uh, the, the, the women were definitely improving like we kind of talked about a couple days ago ago and uh, I, I was very pleased with their performance overall no doubt about it right one of the individual females that you talked about in the preview was Katie Hovind she mm -hmm. definitely delivered today was that what you thought you do a little bit ahead of what you thought or just talk about her race you know it was really tough to say and, and I've kind of talked about that with them in practice you know people have kind of shifted into the lineup at different paces this time of year uh, largely because either coming off of like I've said with Hope a world championship performance uh, and, and and then Katie, Katie kind of having a little bit of a delayed start uh, with her training so uh, I didn't know what to expect 100% from them but it wasn't surprising uh, what they performed how they performed today uh, but I again I think they just answered the call more than anything and did exactly what they were you know right on pace to do and uh, did, did a spectacular job as I told Hope I said hey your strength is coming you're going to be there when the time is right so um, overall uh, collectively the women did a great job no doubt about it. On the men's side, maybe didn't finish as high as a team as we would have wanted to, but Matt McClintock did what Matt McClintock does. What would you like about his race? Sure. I thought Matt did a phenomenal job. Again, he set the tone as, as he's used to doing, and uh, I think now, uh, you know, as far as where he's at in his training, uh, you know, we by no means backed off for this race. Um, we're preparing for things much, uh, again, much more uh, down the road um, from a level of importance, and so I think, you know, Matt did a spectacular job of setting the tone for the team. Uh, the supporting cast though behind them, uh, they're a lot better than what they put out there today. That was uh, definitely disappointing. Um, but again, they, they know what they need to do. And, and as I told them, I said, hey, if we're going to do it in practice, we need to answer the call and do it in the race. So uh, they know what they need to fix. And uh, again, it, uh, you know, we don't have to reinvent the wheel. It's just a matter now of getting their confidence back and get the wheels back underneath them. And, and uh, they'll be ready to go at, at Notre Dame, no doubt about it. One last thing, you talked about consistency being the thing that drives the team uh, in the preview. How do you get those guys and the, the girls team too how do you get them to be consistent especially into the back half of the schedule I think with starting off with races like they are today and being consistent in practice uh, you know one thing we want to be is consistent at being consistent not being consistent at being inconsistent and so uh, you know I, I think it all stems from practice where, you know how they perform there how they group up as a team how they how their pack forms together um, and then I think again that translates over to the race uh, you know one thing I and I before I have to give these guys credit to you know Ben Anderson uh, Jake Hannawalt Matt Greider those three guys stepped it up big today and I hope I'm not forgetting anybody else and leaving them out but they did a phenomenal job and so those guys are again perfect example of showing consistency in practice and then they took it out in the open race today and really did a spectacular job so uh, really pleased with that